So, bit of a turn of events in the vlog. Morning guys, James here from NK Prestige. It's a little bit chilly, but it's a sunny day today. We've got a busy, busy day today with it being month end, and we're going to start doing something new for you guys. We've talked about it for a while between ourselves, but we think it's time we did a vlog. So you can see what a day in a life at NK or any motor dealership is actually like. Do we just sit there all day with our feet up drinking tea? Some of you probably think so. Do we actually bother to check all our cars and make sure that they are the best of the best? You will find out. So uh, thank you very much and uh, it's time for the vlog to start. Was that one take? No. no. We you do ruined it by starting the car, I had to start. Exchange against our brand new Audi S6. So keep an eye out for the... Uh, so close. Right guys, so we're just after taking in this uh, uh, Audi. Right guys, so we're just after taking in this <laughs> Land Rover Range Rover Vogue. Land Rover. Right guys, so we're just after taking in this Range Rover Vogue and uh, I'm sure you'll be seeing it on our website in the next few days. Luca's got this Kia Stinger going out. I just thought I'd show you around it. The customer has requested this ceramic coating on the vehicle. Basically what happens with this one is it gets a full detail inside and outside. Um, if you are looking for this on your vehicle, just request it when you're purchasing and we can have this organized by one of our professional team. We've got Reese in the background here sorting out this vehicle for Luca's customer today. Makes the paint work absolutely incredible. Highly recommend it on any of the vehicles we have in stock. Get in touch with us and you, this one could be you soon. Amazing. Was there a V5 on uh, yes, there was. Luca, you're just. Every time I see him walk around, he's looking for a V5. It's unbelievable, literally. <laughs> All he does is look for a V5. <laughs> Management skills. You're the cost of coffee. <laughs> so it's our first handover today. We've got our beautiful 21 play S6 being prepared round here let's go and have a look with the prep team and let's see how they're getting on so here we have reese and joe preparing the cars so that all the cars are being polished out here the hoovered inside the fully detailed just need the tire shine going on this x6 and that'll be ready against the s6 we actually have a part exchange so if we come down here this is where we start checking our cars so Prasan and his team will be checking the service history on this car. We check the bodywork fully for any sort of paint. Check the tyres are at three millimetre, which is the lowest we will ever take the uh, take the tyres. So anything less than that, you get new tyres all around the car. So Prasan's there, let's have a look. This customer's definitely given it a little clean before he's bought it today, which is nice. The car's looking very tidy. Got a panoramic roof. We want the best spec cars here at NK. So these are the things we check for. The best spec cars, we'll pay the best money for them. So the things that we look for, which are the extras, normally is the panoramic roof. Does it have the side steps? Has it got the upgraded alloy wheels? This car's looking good. Check all the electrics, we'll check everything's working on it. Then we'll take the car out for a drive as well. Right guys, so Kenny is driving away in his brand new Audi S6 now. He's over the moon with the new vehicle. His part exchange was perfect, exactly how he's described it. So we can't wait to put that up on our website. Later on, lovely bit of stock for you to have a look at. Um, but yeah, really easy experience, Kenny. We inquired on Friday. It's now Monday, all deals done, everything ready to go. So uh, enjoy the new vehicle, Kenny. Thank you very much for the business. Just walking down now to pick up a rare beast out in the open. It's come on a flatbed truck that looks flat from here, can't support the weight of the car. So we'll have to go and see what that's all about. <laughs> so this is the beast. Look at it, RSQ8 finishing this metallic grey paintwork. I mean, look at it, it's bigger than the truck. Look at those alloys, it's bigger than the truck. 
Oh my god, it's mad. I can't remember the last time we um, took delivery of a car like this one. I think we've had a few. RS6 was the RS6, yeah. Yeah, it looks blue, same set of format. Around the back. Naughty. Naughty, what's naughty? The car. <laughs> <laughs> what, thought you meant me? No, no. <laughs> no, how do you know that? <laughs> it, it is, I mean, look at it. It's amazing. We've got the gloss black exhaust tips, we've got the diffuser also finished in gloss black. I mean you're talking over 20 grand's worth of kit right here, it's extraordinary scenes here at NK Prestige. So this is the all new Audi RS Q8, so this is their luxury SUV, I mean it's top of the range and you're talking about 600 brake horsepower, you've got Quattro all-wheel drive system, panoramic roof, I mean, being the Volkswagen, it's got every single option you could ask for. I mean, heated seats, you've got 360 cameras, you've got panoramic roof, you've got matrix LED lights, and it just is the bollocks, this car. One of the best on the road, and we're just going to get it down now, if you can see the truck. Um, who's ready to unload the beast. Eloys are quite big, aren't they? So <laughs> we need to make sure that... How big are they? Oh, 22s. 22s. Actually, it might be 23s. Twenty threes! Oh my god, I don't think you can get a bigger alloy on a no. car. I've not seen a bigger alloy than a 23 inch on them. It doesn't even look like it's been driven yet. I mean, look in there, you can see all the mechanisms. Suspension, RS brakes, alloys looking polished to perfection. <laughs> We're about to drive it off the truck. <laughs> the RSQA has been unloaded and it looks absolutely fantastic. I mean, look at the bodywork, the front lights, it's just amazing with the amount of aggression that this car has. So let's jump in, make sure everything's spot on with the car, and then we'll take it over to NK. So we're now in the RSQ8, and what a place to sit. I mean, you've got the full Alcantara wheel, everything is touchscreen, large displays, and you've got the panoramic roof as well here, which in this car really gives it that absolute edge. What a machine. I think NK Prestige Motors are very privileged and happy to be receiving delivery of this car. And as you can see on the odometer there, it's only on 10 miles. So that is crazy. I think that's the lowest mileage car I've ever sat in. So really pleased to be here. Everything looks tip top condition. So we're really happy about that. Um, so let's go and take it over to NK Prestige. We've got the 360 camera and everything, it's just such a beautiful car. Not bad for a Monday. I know, it's an amazing treat to just take delivery of this. It's like Christmas and birthday all combined <laughs> together. So let's pull in here. We're gonna try and keep this car on 10 miles, doing a little bit up and down in the showroom and probably add that on. I mean, to me, this is the light Aorus equivalent like to the RSQ8. I know like the RSQ8 itself is, but the fully kitted up RSQ8 oh, yeah. is a little bit more sort of Aorus level. Thing. Well, that's the thing. I think the Audi RSQ8 is the ultimate Audi. Now things are all going towards a more SUV orientated. You've got the X8 or the MX8 that's coming out. You've got the Ferrari 4x4 coming out. You've got the Urus, they'll update that as well. Bentayga. You've got Cullinan, and this for me, it sits right up there, and it's got more street cred than all those cars combined. Not so, bad. in the bay, we are safe, we are secure, and this car will go to one very lucky customer. So, guys, we've just parked up the brand new RSQA. Let's go and see what the rest of the sales team's up to.
So guys, as you would have just seen, I'm just after selling the Kia Stinger and we've got in this lovely part exchange. Now it's not something we usually sell, it's a Kia Soul, but this particular one is 200 brake horsepower and it's fully specced out. So if we have a look at the inside, we've got a panoramic roof, we've got a JBL sound system, front and rear heated seats, we've got a heated steering wheel as well. So it's low mileage, still under manufacturer's warranty, so why wouldn't we retail it? So take a look at it on our website. It's up there for all you to have a look at. Uh, the videos, photos, all be up there with the full spec sheet. So if you're in the market for a vehicle like this, give us a call. Or if you're in the market for a Lamborghini Urus, give us a call because we have one of those in the showroom as well. That's it, yeah. Right guys, so that's January over and done with for ourselves. Last car is just after being collected, our Kia Stinger. Thank you very much to everyone who collected vehicles through us. Through us. You're becoming a me now, mate. You're about to swallow the tapes. I, I was so good when I started. Come on, Luca. Get it done, boy. <laughs> Right guys, so that's January over and done with. Our last car is after being collected for the month of January, our Kia Stinger. Thank you very much Andy for the business and we also um, handed over our brand new Audi S6 earlier on in the day. Thank you very much to everyone for the business throughout January. It was extremely busy. Uh, great month for ourselves. Jamal came out on top. I came out second, Robin third. I'm sure you all seen our targets there on Instagram as well. Um, so today we're just taking in an Audi RS Q8, four sprung edition, brand new, 10 miles in the vehicle. Um, loads of other stuff going on, loads of cars going out. We have a 320D in for a ghost immobilizer as well today. Um, so yeah, that's about it. All wrapped up for today. See you all tomorrow. So that's all done for us, send you the confirmation on WhatsApp. Uh, so that's all secured for you. As soon as the found out the is an update, give you a call, mate. We'll not listen to us stuff, mate. All right. We have just deposited the first car of the day, first of many, the Land Rover Sport BV18. The best car on site. <laughs> it's got to be the best car. Robin, wouldn't you agree? No. <laughs> <laughs> Every deal is the best car on site because at that moment in time you have made a happy customer. That's it. A good, so let's get a on good, to the next a one. Good Tuesday morning so far. That's it, Tuesday it? morning active. It's only 10 o'clock. Car's been clamped. Yeah. Active. Deposits have been taken. People are dying out here. <laughs> Yeah, so obviously the vehicle is, it was a part exchange at NK. It's gone over to Pennington this morning for an MOT and obviously they just parked it up on the side of the road so they can do the um, fine to get the camp moved. Obviously I've explained to them that it's, over, it's literally just left side, gone over there for an MOT. Just parked up briefly while we're... Uh... Yes, percent. Watch out, you take it out. <laughs> Come on, Prasanta. <laughs> yeah. We just put it there. Uh, basically, it's got no tax in it, basically. Yeah, we just paid it. Exactly. If we put a flipping tray plate in it, is it gonna, it's going to sort the situation out then. What's that? Give us the update. <laughs> oh mate, no update mate. DVLA fella. Boy, Cal, Jamal came out on smoke as well. Jamal came out like, yeah, let's get this done. And then went inside like the e-port. <laughs> <laughs> it's the media team's turn. RSQA, brand new. Absolutely mega car. So we saw it yesterday. Uh, me and Jamal took delivery of it. Um, now Reese is back on the scene. So uh, we've got 320i over there. So I'm just going to move that car and then I'm going to put this car in position. So it'll be live on the website and on our social media channels very soon. But I'm excited about this thing. This is absolutely incredible. I know we saw it a little bit yesterday, didn't we? But I mean, 23 inch alloys, Alcantara wheel, the Alcantara shifter, um, it's what, 600 brake horsepower or something? 
absolutely ridiculous. From an SUV, it's an absolute weapon. We've driven a few of them. Soft closed doors. Beautiful. So let's get this car moved. Let's get this one in position and do some awesome photos for the website and for social media. Keep going. Well, that's compact up anyway, so... so well, well, wait, 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 what? what were you just talking to Cam about? I was asking what car I should put in the showroom. Because I'm always confused, but... I think the Ferrari... We always need a place for ceramics, so that's where the Ferrari is. But the Ferrari died, so the battery died on that. So now that's on trickle, because we have to put the Hurricane where the Ferrari was. And it's, it's just all a bit thing, no one put it back on trickle. Anyway, that's on trickle now. Um, but I think the ultra blue RS6 is going to go in the showroom a bit later, so we'll film that when we pull it in. That thing's just incredible, that car. Um, we need a bit of colour anyway, we, we always like a bit of colour. Bright orange hurricane, bright white, Boris, black Ferrari, red interior. I think the ultra blue RS6 winner. Because we could put this in, but it's two big cars, isn't it? So I'm not, I'm not too sure, but we'll put this over there anyway. Whoa. Oh, I love this thing. Carbon, electric seats, the steering wheel so soft. Brand new in it, so dynamic. It's got all, of all of it. Oh. Have a listen to that. Okay, right. So, bit of a turn of events in the vlog. Now behind us we have the Orca Black RSQ8 and we are in the 71 plate RSQ8 and we're just literally nipping two minutes up the road in these two cars to get some absolutely amazing shots hopefully and a couple of nice little videos and we get to take you along for it as well but first time driving this thing obviously Jamal, me and Jamal collected it but and I'll drive it to the showroom, literally 500 yards. Yeah. But we're literally just going right here, two seconds up the road. Um, I'm gonna put them both together. So you'll see us maneuvering them. And then we're gonna get some cool photos, which I'll also throw into the edit here. So let's jump out, let's position the cars and uh, get some amazing content. All right guys, so we've stopped off, as you've just seen in the car with the Vorsprung 71 plate RSQ8 and we also have behind that the Orca Black 20 plate RSQ8 so both these cars were literally two minutes away from NK but we had to get these up here a little bit bigger space nice and wide but let's have a quick little look at the two differences between these cars because there isn't really any differences in these cars this one the 71 plate is finished in Daytona grey and then this one over here is finished in Orca Black, both absolutely beautiful. Again, roof rails, which on the Vorsprungs, I think there's only one or two options that are not included with the Vorsprung, and again, are optional extras. Now, both of these cars have those optional extras, including the red calipers with the RS logo. Both cars have those. The black roof rails, which again is really important. They just sort of complete the whole look of the car. Two different paint schemes, um, both I don't think cost anything from Audi, um, but both are absolutely fantastic because these are pearl paints. So the Orca Black is a really nice, dark, rich black, where the Daytona Grey is a little lighter, and it's sort of got that nice sort of fleck in the sun as well. Looks absolutely amazing. Again, with the red RS brake calipers. Looks absolutely unbelievable, these things. Again, both these cars have the carbon fiber interiors. They have the suede steering wheel and shifter and they just look absolutely fantastic. Both pan roofs open. We've taken some shots and we're gonna get a couple of little cutaways as well of both of these cars. Both absolutely unbelievable, unbelievable machines. Some amazing pictures, so I'll throw those in the vlog as well for you guys to have a look. I absolutely love them, but let me know what you think in the comments of this video. Do you like the Daytona Grey RSQA or are you a fan of the Orca Black? A bit more stealth, a bit more darker. You have to let me know. But we'll do a little comparison video now between the two and also there'll be a bunch of content on our instagram and facebook as well so stay tuned for that if you haven't already then head over check out the instagram at nk.prestige 
Facebook, NK Prestige Motors. Um, obviously, subscribe to the YouTube and like the video as we go. But um, yeah, absolutely unbelievable to bring these cars out. How was that, Jamal? Way! <laughs> Give you this, lad. Put it in your pocket. <laughs> Christmas present. <laughs> There's the bonus. So he's one of our loyal customers that we've recently spoken to. Always comes down. I think he's bought about 20 cars from us and just another one to his collection, BMW X5. Very I think nice. he's one of the biggest barbers in Huddersfield, so he's cutting everyone's hair, making pee, making bread, making hair. <laughs> and loving life so we're gonna just do the paperwork now finish off for the day and uh, get back at it tomorrow my Luca <laughs> Good morning, James. How are you today? Morning. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Top of the morning to you. <laughs> so, Luca, explain to me what you're doing. So, right now, I'm taking a few pictures of the Range Rover Lair, just after coming in. Got a black pack put on, it's fully specced out, so I don't see why this won't stick around. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. Take a few pictures of the outside, pictures of the inside, put them up on the story, and hopefully someone will come and buy it. Are you looking for a V5? No, I'm not looking for a V5. Are you sure? Well, are you sure? <laughs> thought you were looking for another V5. <laughs> so, 71 plate, E63S. TikTok time. Content creation. What is it? The rear of the car. First, yeah. Rear of the car first. I mean, this thing's just... I mean, can we just appreciate the looks of this car? I mean, a lot sleeker, a lot more aerodynamic, sort of the way it's made and built. Um, yeah, front bumpers changed, lights have changed. I believe the bonnet's sort of the same shape. Um, to me, it seems like it's got a lower stance to the car as well, um, which is really nice. And overall, it's just, it's an updated body. Updated engine, I think, is it? Or is it the same engine, just tuned? I don't know. Jamal is normally the one that rambles about all that stuff. Well, that's never good. <laughs> you know the code, right? Right, guys, so as I've just found out, this vehicle has a ghost immobilizer on it. <laughs> Right guys, so I'm just going to give you a quick look around our stock at the moment. We have a variety of stock in at the moment, so a bit of everything to be honest. Um, obviously it's winter, so it is SUV season. That means we've stocked up on SUVs. So at the moment I think we have 9 or 10 Range Rovers in stock. We've got everything from your standard Sport to Velar or Dynamics. Two, we've got the SVRs and we've also got a Defender in stock as well. Now those Defenders are extremely hard to come by at the moment. We have that in stock available today. Um, a variety of other stuff, so we've got Porsche Cayenne. We've got the new RS3 on site ready to go, that's a launch edition. We've got the older model RS3, loads of them. 
we have M3s, then coming across we have a brand new A45S, GLC 63, E63S, that's the 71 plate, new model, that is absolutely stunning that vehicle, that shouldn't hang around too long. We've got Porsches, we've got Aston Martins, we've got Lamborghinis inside, we've got a bit of absolutely everything, so come on down, take a look at the website and buy something off us. Uh, are you dropping it off? Uh, yeah, drop it round back if possible, mate. Like that, yeah? Yeah, yeah. A couple of deliveries. I mean, that's the one that came last time, though. Yeah, yeah, SQ5, yeah, yeah. So, SQ5 just arriving and A35 has literally just been dropped off by Mercedes. Here it is, blacked out. Looks incredible. What a car, and I've got the keys. So let's have a little look at it and uh, we'll go through some of the spec of this absolute beast. A wild James working. You can see a wild James. It's a wild James in the habitat. It is Thursday and we've had delivery day once again this week. So I've got the keys to the SQ5 that's right behind me right there, 6 7 plate. Um, that's come back to us and I think he's now ready and it's check and we've just taken delivery of this A35 from Mercedes brand new 71 plate I think uh, 170 some miles on it uh, so brand new delivery mileage um, it's literally just arrived from Mercedes and we had a picture the other day of it getting prepped and ready um, at Mercedes somewhere <laughs> <laughs> I don't know which Mercedes it's from. The A35 for me is sort of that daily overall. It's not too powerful, uh, but it looks really good. It's got the interior to match. Uh, so I've got the keys right here. That little look, obviously it's got the, um, it's got the aero pack. It's got all the kit and everything else on it. Oh, and uh, we've just had a, another delivery. M3 Competition X Drive, the first here at NK. Put it there for now. Wow. That was mega. I mean, three cars in one pretty much. A35, SQ5, and the M3 Comp. So, as we've said, the BMW M3 Competition X Drive is now in stock here at NK, and look how good this thing looks. Now, we know the M3 because it's been here before here at NK, but the dual grille right there at the front, those LED lights, and I mean, this thing just looks so mean and aggressive. Now, I've not driven this yet, but I think this has to be a nine day difference between this X drive and the two real wheel drive. I mean, let's have a look at the specs. So finished in Brooklyn gray, gloss black wheels, looks absolutely mega and sounds so good. If you can just hear the idling rumble. That just sounds incredible. It does have that carbon roof up top and on the inside, if we just have a little look, it does have that carbon interior. How good is that? Oh my god guys, this is a new piece of kit for NK Prestige, just come off the container from Germany, A35 Premium Plus, and what a machine, pops and crackles and it's only on delivery miles, let's see what this car's saying then, go, let's go, come over here guys. This is an absolute beast, you've got suspension mode. You've got the sport mode. You've got so many different features with this car. And I think you don't need to pay the money for the A45 because this, on UK roads, ticks a lot of boxes. Traction control off to give you a little bit more fun because really 300 horsepower with a manual gearbox and traction off is all you need in the UK. 
anything over that is only for the racetrack or you're gonna get yourself killed in my opinion so but it's just an amazing car overall you can see how fresh it is when we get new cars into NK Prestige it's just such a joy I mean what do you think of it James absolutely love it amazing car isn't it and you can see here it's got sort of the classic Mercedes styling I'm not a fan of the new grill I prefer the old style it's called the shooting star grill um, but you see on the likes of like the SLS um, and a few other sort of famous cars that they've had in the past so for me it's an absolute machine especially with the aero kit as well upgraded alloys these are the more desirable ones on the car it's just pretty much everything you need so I'm quite chuffed hopefully I'll sell this one and I'll see you a little bit later on when I've sold it <laughs> Hi guys, Luca here, and now it's Friday morning. Thankfully the week is over, but we've a busy weekend ahead of us. So here at NK, we're just after getting in the Mercedes C-Class this morning, 2017 Coupe. We got in our M3 X Drive yesterday, our 71 plate, and we also got in a brand new Mercedes-Benz A35S. So loads of stuff going on here today, and the lads will give you a quick look at the, those vehicles that are just after coming in. But uh, for the moment, I'm gonna go inside and get selling a few cars. Guys, it's been an amazing first vlog here at NK Prestige and we'd like your feedback. Tell us what we should do on the next one. Any sort of challenges, ways that we can sort of promote the business, selling cars and things like that. We're doing a lot of Valentine stuff as well in the coming week, so keep an eye out for that one. And we'll hit you with an even better vlog next week. So take care from NK Prestige.